we are dealing with the three enemies the flesh the world and the powers of darkness so today we are dealing with one of them flesh so to find that we are going to the scripture itself let the scripture explain what the flesh is now, romans chapter 7 verse 5 for when we were controlled by the sinful nature the sinful passions aroused by the law were at work in our bodies so that we bore fruit for death this particular verse has made st paul really be hated by the jewish theologians even up to today because they said the law itself is divine and by the way sister a fish does not know that it is in the water do you know when they will realize that water is essential for them when they are pulled out of the water when do we know we need air when we don't have it you struggle to breathe and then only you realize when you have got used to oxygen you never don't even think about it. in the same way when people have lived all their life in the flesh all of us think that the life in the flesh is the only life possible and available so in the life of the flesh there are certain characteristics that are common a person living in the flesh is focused on themselves so a life centered on ourselves has a name and that name is called the flesh my brother my sister until you discover the flesh you will never find the new life of god the flesh is the natural thing that's hidden from us and from the world with everybody is in the flesh and then st paul asks a question in verse 24 what a wretched man i am who will rescue me from this body of death come on my sister this experience of wretchedness is actually the moment we are invited to realize that jesus is able to give us a new life